and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going over some mail that I was received here during the holiday season from different good friends of mine that also have YouTube channels and you'll want to go check them out too. I'm going to leave a link to all these channels in my description, description so you can go check them out. So let's get started and see who our first one is. The first one up is the Harvey Five with Santa Claus and the puppies. Isn't that cute? Aw, Santa Claus holding the little puppies. Wishing you a home filled with joy and special moments this Christmas. Love, Larry, Leslie, Caroline, Jackson, and Macy. You you haven't checked out their channel, The Harvey Five. You need to go to. Go check them out. They have all kinds of little fun adventures with the kids. They go different places. And they even come here to the Smoky Mountains, too, and do some filming there. So you'll want to go and check out their channel. They're really sweet people. The next one up is Rockin' Robin's Adventures and Robin's Dolly World. Look at that. It shows us Santa Claus and his sleigh going over a bridge. Just looks so peaceful and pretty in the winter time. Ugh. You'll have to check out her channel. She has a collection of dolls. She collects dolls and they just look so lifelike. They're so cute and so pretty. You just need to go check her channel out too. The next one up is from Bone Daddy 2, Mike and Tam. Oh, this couple, they find all kinds of unique places in the Smoky Mountains and Georgia. Oh, they find some really neat little hidden gems that someone may not know about unless you go watch their video. I mean, they go to festivals, they go to parades, they go, they go and do everything. This couple is something else. And I love this card. It's so old-fashioned looking. The two children out there building a snowman. It just looks so cute. And the next one up is from Adventures in the Heartland, John and Jan. And I shouldn't have known this when I first looked at the card because Jan is a big Disney person. Bambi. It says, wishing you both a Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year and best wishes for the New Year. John and Jan from Ventures in the Heartland. Aren't they just, isn't they just cute? Now this channel, they do fishing, hiking, cooking, and Jan is, she, she just has a natural gift on glass. She does some glass work, stained glass work, and it's just beautiful. You need to go and check out her channel too. The next one up is from Just Out and About. There they are. These people love amusement parks. So if you're an amusement park lover, lover, you need to go check them out. They go to Disney, Carowinds, Dollywood, everywhere. And they love amusement parks and different events like that. So you need to go check them out. Now next up is a gift from Misfits and Dreamers. Let's see what Bob sent us in the mail. Woo. Okay, wonder what we got in here. Ooh, Bob, now if you don't, if you never watched this channel, you should. Bob is a cook and a half. This guy can cook everything. Oh, he is a chef. And they live up in New York, and they have some wonderful videos of different places up there in New York. And the first thing up is a card. It says, Merry and Bright. Oh, with love, Bob and Bonnie from Misfits and Dreamers. Isn't that pretty? Oh, it just looks so peaceful and nice. Okay. He said, this is some homemade goodies. 
I'm going to need my scissors again because he wrapped this up really good. See? He wrapped it really good. Of course, anymore and when you ship things in the mail, you need to do that. Oh, let's see if I can get into this. Oh. He said it's some homemade goodies of his. Homemade Buckeyes. Drop my card. Yeah, it's homemade Buckeyes. Oh, I love those. My, my mom and my grandma always made those. I never did make them. Never did have much luck. I'm not the chef. <laughs> He included his card. I wonder if y'all can see that. Misfits and Dreamers. That's another channel you need to check out because, like I said, he is one big cook. Big cook. Ooh. Let's see if I can get into one of these. We'll do a taste test. Oh, these are so good. Mmm. Oh, thank you, Bob. Thank you, thank you, thank you. That brings back a lot of memories because, like I said, my mom made them and my grandma also, but I just never was the accomplished one. Things just never did turn around. Like, like when I made fudge, you could eat it with a spoon. Or if I made divinity, eat it with a spoon. I just won the candy maker. And I always said, if you never need to build a house, come check this girl out. Because my homemade bread turns out like bricks. So, I can supply you some bricks to build a home. Thank you so much. These cards mean so much to me. I love getting cards in the mail. Just a simple little note saying, thank you, thinking of you. That is something... A lot of people have stopped doing and it's sad I mean my mom just loves sending cards out or a thank you or just a simple little note say hi how are you doing today we just don't do it I mean I guess since the post posties just started going up a little bit we just stopped doing it and of course the internet we just get on there and send people messages but we just don't do it much anymore and I love getting cards I have friends back in Indiana I went to school with, and never fails. Every year, all the time, on my birthday, Easter, whatever, I got a couple that send me a card all the time saying, Hey, thinking of you. How's your day? Happy holidays, or whatever. But it's something I think we all need to get in back in practice with. Just a simple little note to say, Hi, how you doing? Thinking of you. And then this and not get on the internet and send it out on one of the social media sites. Just do a little personal note every now and then. It can really brighten up a day. You never know what someone's going through, anything in life. And that little note just might brighten their day for good. It, ne it doesn't hurt. I mean, we stop making phone calls most of the time. We send texts over the phone, and I'm guilty of it. Instead of picking up the phone and saying, hey, how are you doing today? Is there anything I could do for you? And it's just it's just something that can brighten someone's day and letting them know that you're thinking about them. So, just remember that. I love sending out cards. So, just, just think about people every now and then because we all don't know what each other is going through in our life. Every day, it could be something. I mean, you just, it will uplift somebody in their heart very much. So, that's it for this video. Get this video a big thumbs up. And hit that subscribe button and hit that bell so you'll never miss another video. Because I got a big video coming out for Christmas Day. I'm so excited. Oh, I, this is something that's very dear to my heart. And... I just can't wait to share it with y'all. So, I'll see you in the next video. And remember, 
your next adventure, your next dream is just over the horizon. So, see you in the next video. Thank you.